Picture this, you're six months out from your wedding date, and your venue was booked about a year and a half in advance, and you find out that venue is closing down, and they won't host your wedding. I just basically said, hey, this is what we're hearing about Southwind. It sounds like they're going into foreclosure. Um, we're going to need to look for a new venue. It's a real situation brides in the Norman area are facing. Amanda told me she found out Thursday from her own wedding planner. Um, I was speechless. And all this as she was about to send in the final payments she owed. Southwind Hills is where Amanda had planned to say I do. We only had two payments left on the venue. She did get a sympathetic email from the venue management this morning saying the venue has faced a quote critical financial matter and fight with the bank. The email also says they reached out to investors for support but never got enough in return to stay open. The email also notes there will be a refund process. They're going to start having meetings about refunds, but uh, there's no timeline on when the refund will be issued. Amanda was able to find a new venue. She booked it quickly, but now she has more work to do that she wasn't planning on. Now I have to figure out what vendors I need for this new venue, and I have to go walk through this new venue and see it in person. And she thinks there are dozens of other brides that are now in her position. Not every bride is as lucky as I was to find a venue so quick and you know a lot of us have out-of-state guests that have to travel. Amanda says she was able to keep her original wedding date in July but says other brides may not be able to do that. <laughs>